you. Hi, hey, hello, how are you? Hi, hey, hello, how are you? I'm so glad you're here. Are you ready to sing a song? Are you ready to sing along? Are you ready to dance around? Are you ready to make a sound? Hi, hey, hello, how are you? Hi, hey, hello, how are you? Hi, hey, hello, how are you? I'm so glad you're here. Are you ready to sing a song? Are you ready to dance along? Are you ready to make a sound? Are you ready to dance around? Hi, hey, hello, how are you? Hi, hey, hello, how are you? Hi, hey, hello, how are you? I'm so glad you're here. I'm so glad you're here. I'm so glad you're here. Welcome to Alive with Lindsay. I am so happy you're here. Thank you so much for taking some time to sing and make music with me today. If this video freezes, don't worry, I'll be right back. That sometimes happens. My iPod is a little bit old, but hopefully it won't happen and we can have a lot of fun together singing some songs. So hello and Halliburton, yay, that's awesome. That's where my parents live. It's great to see people from there watching along. So I wanna start Oh yes, yeah. so if you if you can put where you're watching from and your name in the comments, I'd love to give you a shout out. Um, so you can do that at any time. And so the first song that I want to sing with you guys. Yay, we're back. Okay. That was that was a little commercial break, a little freezing commercial break. Hey, Whitney is here. Hey, Whitney and hey, Ewan and Emmett from Ontario watching. I loved seeing you guys dancing and singing along to my video from last week. That was wonderful and I hope you have a lot of fun today as well. So today I want to sing a song with you guys about animals. Let me know what's your favorite animal or if you have more than one favorite animal, let me know what are your favorite animals and put them in the comments so I can see. This song that I want to sing with you has seven, seven different animals in it. Okay, and each one of We're back. Okay. So each of the animals has an action that goes with it. So I'm going to show you each one and I want you to do the actions along with me. Are you ready? So the first animal is a crocodile. Okay. And for the crocodile, we're going to go like this. All right. So crocodile, then we have an orangutan and actually I have a picture of a baby orangutan sitting on his mommy orangutan. Isn't that cute? Okay, so for the orangutan, we're gonna go like this. Okay, can you do that? And then, crocodile, orangutan, we're gonna, there's gonna be an eagle. We're gonna flap our arms like an eagle. And then there's gonna be a fox, a silver fox. And for that, we're gonna go like this. Silver fox. And then, there's a bunny, make little bunny ears, a beaver, make little beaver teeth, and a crazy elephant. That's the elephant trunk. Okay, so that's, those are the actions of all the animals in the song. So what's going to happen in the song, we're going to start to sing it all, and do all the actions, and then we're going to sing it again a bunch of times, and each time we're going to take out the word of the animal, but we're going to keep doing the action. You're going to be able to follow along and it's going to be a lot of fun. So if you're ready, let's sing There Was a Crocodile. It goes like this. There was a crocodile, an orangutan, eagles fly, and a silver fox, a bunny, a beaver, a 
crazy elephant. Na 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 na. Now this time we're gonna go like this. There was a an orangutan, eagles fly, and a silver fox, a bunny, a beaver, a crazy elephant. Na 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 na. There was a Eagles fly in a silver fox, a bunny, a beaver, a crazy elephant. Na 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 na. There was a and a silver fox, a bunny, a beaver, a crazy elephant. Na 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 na. There was a a bunny, a beaver, a crazy elephant. Na 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 na. na. There was a A beaver, a crazy elephant, na 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 na. There was a a crazy elephant, na 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 na. There was a. Na 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 One more time with all the animals. There was a crocodile and a rattan. Eagles fly in a silver fox. A bunny, a beaver, a crazy elephant. Na 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 Yeah. Good job, you guys. I hope you like that song. It's one of my favorites, so let's see what kind of animals you guys like. So Emmett says a doggy and Ewan says a cat. Those are my favorite animals too. Do you guys have a dog and a cat? I have a dog named Charlie and a cat named Ninja. And I love dogs and cats. So that's great. And there's Mary, my friend Mary in Quebec watching. Hey Mary, thanks for watching. And okay, next up. We have a song that we did last time that was really fun. And I think a lot of people liked it because I saw some great videos of people dancing and singing along. So this is the song about a special yellow fruit. Do you guys know which one it is? That's right, it's the banana song. So if you didn't catch it last week, I'm gonna explain how it goes. So we're gonna do, we're gonna turn it into a banana. We're gonna go bananas unite, okay? Become a banana like that, okay? Bananas unite, and we're gonna peel bananas, peel, peel bananas, peel bananas, peel, peel bananas, slice bananas, slice, slice bananas, slice bananas, slice, slice bananas, eat bananas, eat, eat bananas, eat bananas, eat. Eat bananas, then we go bananas, go, go bananas, go bananas, go, go bananas. And then I say B A N A N A S. And I want to hear you say B A N A N A S. And then again B A N A N A S. B A N A N A S. Go bananas, go, go bananas, go bananas, go, go bananas. You can peel them to the left, you can peel them. You can peel them to the right. You can peel them to the right. You can peel them down the middle. You can peel them down the middle. And ah, uh, take a bite. And ah, uh, take a bite. One more time. Can we do it again? Ready? Bananas unite. Peel bananas. Peel peel bananas. Peel bananas. Peel peel bananas. Slice bananas. 
slice, slice bananas, slice bananas, slice, slice bananas, eat bananas, eat, eat bananas, eat bananas, eat, eat bananas, go bananas, go, go bananas, go bananas, go, go bananas, B A N A N A S, 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 go bananas, go, go bananas, go bananas, go, go bananas, you can peel them to the left. You can peel them to the right. You can peel them to the right. You can peel them down the middle. You can peel them down the middle. And I uh, take a bite. And I uh, take a bite. No more times. Yay! Good job, you guys. I hope you had fun with that song. I love that song. You can watch that one and there was a crocodile on my YouTube channel. If you want to watch that again which I'll put the link to after the video is over. All right, now, uh, again, I wanna say hello to Aurora from Europe, who sent me a really cute video last week singing the banana song. So hi, Aurora. And anyone else who is watching, if you haven't put in your name and where you're from, I'd love to say hi to you. So I'm grateful that you're here with me today. And now I have a really fun song and story about a friend of mine. He's a small friend, he's about this big, and his name is Herman. He's a worm. It's Herman the Worm. And so I'm going to sing the song, and you guys are going to catch along and sing with me and hear the story. Are you ready? So it goes like this. I was sitting on my fence post, chewing my bubble gum, playing with my yo-yo, woo woo when along came Herman the Worm, and he was this big. And I said, Herman, what happened to you? I ate my brother. And I said, Herman, you's a bad worm. But the very next day, I was sitting on my fence post, chewing my bubble gum, playing with my yo-yo, woo-woo. When along came Herman the Worm. And he was this big. And I said, Herman, what happened to you? I ate my sister. And I said, Herman, you's a bad worm. But the very next day, I was sitting on my fence post, chewing my bubble gum, playing with my yo-yo, woo-woo. When along came Herman the worm. And he was this big. And I said, Herman, what happened to you? I ate my mother. And I said, Herman, he's a bad worm. But the very next day, I was sitting on my fence post, chewing my bubble gum, playing with my yo-yo, woo-woo. When along came Herman the worm, and he was this big. And I said, Herman, what happened to you? I ate my father. Herman, you's a bad worm. But the very next day, I was sitting on my fence post, chewing my bubble gum, playing with my yo-yo, woo-woo. When along came Herman the worm, and he was this big. And I said, Herman, what happened to you? I burped. That's the song, that's the story, isn't that fun? Give me some hearts if you like that song. All right. Yeah. All right, so thank you again so much guys for joining me today. I'm having so much fun and I hope you are too. I got out my ukulele, and I want to sing a song about a liver pill. This is a song my dad taught me when I was a little girl, and there's some fun parts that go with it. There's some parts that go, hmm, and some parts that go, oh. So I love if you guys can join me when I sing those parts, and if you already know the song, then sing along with me as well. So it goes like this. How 
does a little liver pill when you're ill. Know where your liver is. Here we go. Hmm. How does he know the correct way to go? How does he know? Hmm. He has no eyes to see with. And here we go. Oh. He has no legs to walk with. Oh. So how does a little liver pill when you're ill? Know where your liver is. Hmm. Let's do it again. How does a little liver pill when you're ill know where your liver is? Hmm? How does he know the correct way to go? How does he know? Hmm? He has no to see with oh he has no legs to walk with oh so how does a little liver pill when you're ill know where your liver is Have Kelly watching from South Africa. That's amazing. I used to live in South Africa for one year and I loved it. So I'm really happy to see you here. Okay, so that was Liver Pill. That's on my first album, You Are Amazing, which you can listen to on Spotify and YouTube and everywhere music is streamed online. Okay, now I have a song for you about a truck. Do you know what kind of a truck it could be? It's my son's, Shasta and Sebastian's favorite truck. And it comes every week, three times a week, to do a really super important job. It's so important that I wrote a song about it. And it goes like this. When I grow up, I want to drive a garbage truck. I'm going to pick up so much garbage that I might get stuck. I'm going to clean up the streets and say hi to all the kids I meet. And when I'm done, I think I might grab a bite to eat. Some people think that the garbage truck makes a great big stink. But I don't mind, I'll just keep on driving my garbage truck. Some people say that the garbage truck gets in the way, but I don't mind, I'll just keep on driving my garbage truck. When you grow up, do you want to drive a garbage truck? Will you pick up so much garbage that you might get stuck? Will you clean up the streets and say hi to all the kids who meet? And when you're done, do you think you might grab a bite? to eat. Some people think that the garbage truck makes a great big stink, but I don't mind, I'll just keep on driving my garbage truck. And some people say that the garbage truck gets in the way, but I don't mind, I'll just keep on driving my garbage truck. Bottom bump. Yay! I hope you like the garbage truck song. I'm going to be recording that this year on my new album. But there is an acoustic version of it on YouTube if you want to watch and sing along again. And that was especially for Leo from Italy, who loves that song, and sang it to me over a voice message one day, which was super cute. So especially for you, Leo. And now we have another song. It's also on my first album called Treat Others As You Want to Be Treated. So if you know this song, sing along. 
it's a good song to remember these days and every day. It goes like this. What should you do when somebody takes your toy? What should you do when you start to feel annoyed? Just think about this song and it will tell you what to do. We've got to treat others as we want to be treated. Treat others as you want to be treated. Treat others as you want to be treated. Sometimes it's hard, but it's the right thing to treat others as you want to be treated. What should you do when somebody's mean to you? What should you do if your friend is feeling blue? Just think about these words and they will never let you down. We've got to treat others as we want to be treated. Treat others as you want to be treated. Treat others as you want to be treated. Sometimes it's hard, but it's the right thing to treat others as you want to be treated. Sometimes it's hard, but it's the right thing to treat others as you want to be treated. Yay! Thank you guys so much for being here and watching and singing, moving and laughing with me. It's so great to be here with you. Drink of water. All right. I have one more thing for you before I go. It's a book, it's a little book, super little, but don't worry. When I put it up close, you can see it really big. As you can see, it is called Mortimer, and it's by a man named Robert Munch, illustrated by Michael Marchenko, and published by Anna Press. All right, so if you have an instrument in your house or a shaker, you know what? I'm going to show you something. This is my friend, Mr. Fethis, but underneath him, I have this shaker. It's just a bottle with some corn in it. You can decorate it and make your own shaker at home. So if you have something like that, go grab it because there's going to be a chance to use that in the song. But if you don't, that's also okay. You can just bang on the table or stomp your feet any way you can make some noise. Okay, so here we go. Every night, Mortimer's mother took him upstairs. She opened the door to his room, threw him in bed, and said, Mortimer, be quiet. Mortimer shook his head, yes. So she closed the door, went downstairs, and as soon as she got to the bottom of the stairs, Mortimer sang. This is the part where you can make lots of noise. Bang, bang, rattle, ding, bang, gonna make my noise all day. Bang, bang, rattle, ding, bang, gonna make my noise all day. Whenever I say that part, you can make lots of noise, okay? Mortimer's father heard that noise and he came upstairs. He opened the door and said, Mortimer, be quiet. Mortimer shook his head yes, so his father shut the door and went downstairs. As soon as he got to the bottom of the stairs, Mortimer sang, Bang, bang, rattle, ding, bang, gonna make my noise all day. Bang, bang, rattle, ding, bang, gonna make my noise all day. He was not being quiet. Well, 
As soon as Mortimer's seventeen brothers and sisters heard that noise, they all came up the stairs, making an incredible racket. They opened the door and shouted in a loud voice, Mortimer, be quiet! Mortimer put his hands over his ears and shook his head yes. Do you think he listened? They went downstairs, and as soon as they got to the bottom of the stairs, Mortimer sang, Bang, bang, rattling, bang, gonna make my noise all day. Bang, bang, rattling, bang, gonna make my noise all day. Didn't listen. They got so upset that they called the police. Two policemen came and walked very slowly up the stairs. Thump, 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 thump. They opened the door and said in their very deep policemen voices, Mortimer. Be quiet. Mortimer, sh Mortimer hid under the bed and shook his head yes. The policeman closed the door and went downstairs. As soon as they got to the bottom of the stairs, Mortimer sang, Bang, bang, rattling, bang, gonna make my noise all day. Bang, bang, rattling, bang, gonna make my noise all day. Well, everyone was so upset that the mother and the policeman got into a big fight and the brothers and sisters got into a big fight with their father. Upstairs, Mortimer got so tired waiting for somebody else to come up that he fell asleep. The end. All right, my friends, thank you so much for being here with me today. I hope you had fun. And parents, I'd love to see, hear your feedback and help me know how I can make it even better next week. So I hope you have a wonderful day. I'm sending you lots of love. And I'll be posting the replay of this again if you want to watch it and dance along again. And yeah, thanks so much. I'll see you later.